Look who's here, Brianna is here. Hi. Oh, hi. How yeah. are you doing? Pretty good. Oh, good. And Lewis on a Wednesday. Yeah, this what? is just like the old, the old time. Yeah. Lewis is showing up randomly. Yeah, Okay, wow. Freddy. Freddy. Yeah, I'm still on. here. I'm still here. Is he, is he getting here? He Where is he? Where is he over there? He's off to the side. Oh, there he is, yeah. Yo. The master hand. The hand. Hey, everybody. It's Freddy. How are you doing today? When was the last time you were here, Rana? Uh, you might have been, uh, in the winter or the spring. Whoa. Yeah. And now it's the fall. Yeah. So that's a... It's been a long time. I don't know how that happened. Whoa. But it... Um, Whoa. Um, we're things gonna, happen. Uh, we're getting some crazy sounds because we've moved around and it's causing some unknown uh, power fluctuation somewhere. We're, we're trying to get settled still, but it's, uh, there's a lot of uh, variables that are happening. Yeah. So what, what day number of this is new old studio? Day two of the day new two. old studio. Yeah. Retro future studio. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Then yeah. I woke up and I put on some clothes that i have I wore this outfit a lot, like a year ago. You look uh -huh. like you're ready for the winter. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, maybe you wore it a year ago because it was winter a year ago. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Well, I, th I think I I had just moved it's into my house. Right. John Fernelli left this jacket, and I was like, well, he left it, so I'm gonna wear it. But then he came and got a bunch of stuff out of my room recently, but he didn't take this. Cause probably nice. cause he didn't really know it was there. So maybe he wants it back, but maybe not. Well, if he sees this episode, he could call the number. What's that number there? Yeah, oh, yeah, the number is back. Number. We've, this is, uh, a background tape is back, too. We've had the... Um, hey, that's it. The other one going for a couple of days it's now. It's uh, 330-536-3802. Yeah, you can call the number, and you can uh, get your voice on TV. We have some messages. We'll probably check some messages. Here. Oh, yeah. You, I, uh, I, I took a sneak peek. I know we got some Mr. Ginsu in there. Uh, <laughs> maybe... Yeah, lots, hopefully some good messages in there. You see uh, anything on the streets there in the last, well, year? <laughs> Me? Yes. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, man. Cool. Oh. Oh, I don't know what that would have happened with this thing. Whoa. Uh, we got some problems on the machine here, yeah. so... Maybe the viewers, can the viewers hear that? Is it the mm -hmm. static? Is it? Yeah, they can still hear that thing. It's still happening. Yeah. Okay, yeah. sorry about that, viewers. We're trying to work on it. We're doing some production and uh, techniques. Are you sure it's not one of the mics? Oh, uh, yeah. Well, I think, I think we got ba rid of the bad mic. Oh. Maybe it's working better now. There. There we go. I think I fixed it. Oh, it might have been the ocean. Oh. Yeah, now we can hear it better. It was, it was too loud. Uh. All right, Good. thanks for sticking with this, viewers. Rihanna had a, a story from the streets, though, I think. Oh, I was just going to say, I went all over the whole streets of the country since I've been on oh, the yeah. tour last. Wow. Or since I've been on the show last, I went on tour. Where where did you go? Everywhere. You go to... Uh, she really did. She kind of skipped some of the middle states, but... Did you yeah, go to Kansas? Uh, yes. Yeah, we're, we're in Kansas. Uh, well, didn't like stop really in it anywhere. You drove through it? Yeah. The streets. Yeah. The streets, you know, like the shopping places, the, the truck stops. Did you drive through Kansas City, Kansas? Yeah. Went wow. To Kansas City. Actually, I played a show in Kansas City, but Kansas City is in Missouri. Oh. It's not actually in Kansas. That's really not. Well, where is? I should call that Missouri it's City. It's on the border, I think. It's really close to Missouri or Kansas City, though? I mean, Kansas, the state? Yeah, it is. It's really close, but it's not in Kansas. Huh. Why are they doing that trying to confuse people? I don't know. But 
the, this bar that we played a show at there was weird. The guy who we stayed with said that um, the last time he went to a show there, um, he got in a fight with a midget. What? Whoa. So he was like, oh, that's a weird bar to be playing at. And I was like, uh-oh. <laughs> <But> <laughs> that then, sounds like a personal problem to me. Midget, <laughs> fight, midget fight bar. Yeah, but then it was fine. And it was, you know, it was just like a bar show, but there were no midgets there. What about fights? Mm. No fights. There are just some guys playing darts and drinking beer and stuff. I have a, I have a friend who, uh, well, you got, he's a friend of the program too, but Cedar, he is down in Nevada right now, and he says there's lots of bar fights in Nevada. That, Whoa. Uh, oh, yeah. He says that in at least every night there's a bar fight in at least one bar in Nevada. Or maybe he was implying that it was in, like, in any given bar possibly, but... That seems a little crazy. I don't think I bet there's a bar fight somewhere in a state in an entire state. I think that's probably yeah. Like that. But I, uh, I guess he's yeah. talking about Elko, which is a pretty small town. Yeah. Mm, but maybe a lot of bar scene. Apparently, you know, once it goes gets dark, there's nothing much to do but go to the bar. You know. Yeah. Not everyone is uh, a happy drunk. You didn't see any fights on the tour, on the streets or something? No, I didn't. One one night though, I stayed up all night. But I didn't see anything good. I was <laughs> riding around the subways of New York. Whoa. And then like it was dark when I went in and then when I came back out it was daylight. Wow. Was there people there the whole time? I've heard that New York is one of the cities that uh, doesn't it, sleep it very never often. Sleeps. Oh yeah, there were lots of people everywhere. It was weird. Whoa. Even at like three in the yeah, morning? Yeah, there were just people everywhere. What? Three? Nobody, wouldn't they sleep? Yeah. And they, they could still go into places and they were open. What? Like, stores and stuff. That's crazy. Like, you still like, buy alcohol after 2 a.m. there? Yeah, I stayed at a bar until like 4 in the morning. What? City of no rules, more like it. Yeah, and then you can like yeah. start buying. No soda, though, in New York. Oh, oh yeah, yeah they just passed that, right? You can't buy the yeah. giant ones. You can't get the 1.5 liter size? <laughs> can you get this yeah. one? Yeah, can you get this size? It might be too big. <laughs> 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 gotta find out how big. Maybe we can call it. Oh, no, it's too late to call New York McDonald's. How uh, you uh, you I should have call Scott's Duan. Oh yeah. Ooh, that's in New York. I, I mm -hmm. have a little uh, news. Uh huh. Uh, I had, <laughs> and Brianna, Brianna, this is maybe, you know about this because I, you and Cedar, were both telling me last time we all hung out together that I should lock up my bike. You guys were asking me about my bicycle and uh, <gasps> I wasn't really uh -oh. keeping it locked up because uh, in the move, my the key for my bike lock got separated from my actual bike lock, and so and I hadn't really got them back together yet. And so um, my bike was just sort of sitting with the other bikes in front of my building. Oh, and, man. Uh, and then I went down Vancouver, hung out with Brianna and Caitlin and Sean and Cedar, and they were telling me, like, oh, if your bike gets stolen, we're not going to feel bad for you because you should lock it up. And I was like, well, it's probably not going to happen. And then I come back, and the very night I got back from Vancouver, in the night, my bike was stolen. Oh, my God. Yeah. I came out, put my garbage in the dumpster the next morning. Bam. It was gone. Not even there. And there was a bike. I noticed first that there was, like, a bike next to our dumpsters that uh, had a seat off and a tire missing. And it was another Schwinn. Like, mine was a Schwinn. And, uh, and then... A there was a seat on the ground, but the bicycle seat was my seat. This guy, whoever stole oh, my shit. bike, oh, like, man. dismantled his bike with like these bike tools that he also left on the ground and uh, took my seat off my bike and reattached his seat onto the same seat post and then, uh, I guess, probably rode off into the night. He's like oh, a what? mechanic. Asshole. Yeah. He, wow. knew, he knew his stuff, I guess. You know, he, he knew enough to bring bike tools when he wants to steal a bike. So I'm so sorry we even talked about it. I feel like we like made it happen somehow. I think you guys definitely did. But did you hear it's about Seth? No. He got arrested for shoplifting. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, wait, Seth, Seth Vincent? No. no. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know this person. He was on the show I'm before, to too. Be sharing this, yeah. but yesterday, Sean was like, Brianna, I have to tell you something really crazy that happened. Our, yeah, our friend, our, our young friend has started with shoplifting uh, cards, like game po cards. Pokemon cards. Oh, so don't do that out there. Wait, uh, there's still viewers. Pokemon cards coming out? Yeah, it's like big again, I guess. In some other scene that we don't know about. Oh, man. Yeah. So he's, is he in, incarcerated right now? or? No, I think it's like, you know, they like arrested him and 
his mom is mad at him. Of course, yeah. Moms hate shoplifting. Yeah. Wait, is he under 18? Yes. Yeah. Okay, well then it doesn't really matter. Under 18, <laughs> walks off clean. <laughs> Uh, but no, out there, viewers, don't shoplift. That's a bad yeah, idea. Bad. Where did he get no, shot? Caught? Do all the illegal things before you're 18. Hey, look, it's time for the dice game. Oh, let's write numbers on our hands, guys. Yep, don't kill people, because you can't really get away with that one. What else did we talk about at that fire? I think maybe everything that we will talk about is going to come true. I think you're right. We had oh, a lot. Oh, man, you got to look out, yeah. Yeah, be yeah, careful what you say, people. You especially know. around fires. Yeah. Don't curse yourself. There's, there's f power in fire. Don't say stuff around fires that you don't want to come true. Maybe, yeah. Uh, that, like, don't, yeah, no warnings. You have to warn yourself and you have to, like, maybe walk away or something. For a warning. So we're going to write a number on our hands, viewers. You guys can get a pen out, too. If you have one somewhere, find a pen. Write the number between one and six in your hands. We're going to play the dice game. Great. Yeah, here it is. Yeah, oh, the oh, dice. Uh-oh, is that not on? Oh, here it goes. Turn it on. Hey. There it is. What's up, oh, camera? Uh -oh. oh, you just turned it off oh, again. No. Turn that thing back on. <laughs> here we go. There we go. Where's the dice? There's some right here. There's how some dice. How many do you roll? Just two. Two at a time. Two at a time. You have your number? Everybody has a number? I have a, yeah, two yeah. chances to I win. I got mine. Oh, five uh, and two. Five. 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 five and a two. I got a two. I have a two. Oh. I have a five. Oh, five. Oh. Yeah, five oh, and two. Five. Oh, Did right. everyone win except for me? I picked six. I yeah. got, I got <laughs> two. Yep. I got two. Yep, we all five Yay. Yeah. Now after that, we're well, the winners. Everybody except for Lewis. Last time too. Five hundred. Um, yeah, but usually I get I pick six, but I decided to go out. You know, try something new. Yeah, it was a good thing. Uh, oh, there's no Charlie today. Oh yeah, where's Charlie? First time in a while. What's Charlie? Charlie's the dog. <laughs> we could have gone. <laughs> Charlie is a robot What's a Charlie? computer. Oh, I thought maybe it was a, a picture. Oh, oh, yeah, where's all that stuff? Yeah, here? we can get yeah, some of that over here. Where's Sue Reynolds? Sue Reynolds and the Wussy Donkey and Jesus. Some of that stuff is over there. Oh, yeah. What is that? This is old <gasps> oh, my God. I used to have one of these when I was little. Oh, what? Well, this is Circuit Bank. <laughs> yeah, this one does a thing, though. Whoa. Well, here's a, here's a message from Mr. Ginsu. Let's see what Mr. Ginsu has to say today. Oh, that sounds you remember Mr. Ginsu was here around there when uh, last time you were here around probably. Yeah, I think Mr. Ginsu has been around since bef I think he was before me, even. So sitting here watching TV, fucking long comes his chest. Chest on channel 24, it totally blanks out the whole fucking screen and you can't watch nothing going on except for the test. And then on channel 5, you could see the whole thing going down as far as people doing their show. And the test was going across the top of the screen like normal, like proper. Uh -huh. It didn't fucking... Take whatever I was watching, kick it the fuck off the TV, and then fucking emergency broadcast. Only system. show me the test. Hey, fuck you, testos. Hey, fucking testy motherfuckers. He did, he I'm don't... testy too. Who is he mad at? Fuck you, motherfucker. Emergency test broadcast. Get your fucking thing. test right. <laughs> Asshole. Yeah, I hate them too. Fuck them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was watching. I think he was talking about when he was watching the program. I think the other day. It's it's like one of like <laughs> makes that crazy sound and the words. Are like, yeah, it's really harsh. What are they gonna send you? I mean, is like a is that like earthquake alerts or something? Or like, or you know, just like anything bad that could happen. If you're watching TV, bad stuff is happening right now. Look out! Like a tsunami. That might be a nice warning. Yeah, I or guess. Like if Mount Rainier was erupting. You know, like run. Oh uh, yeah, I mean if that was happening, you're probably dead anyways. So. Prepare to die. Watch brain, out. Brain, 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 yeah. Yeah. Death is on the way. Hey, I have a, I have some production news. If uh -huh. we can, maybe, here, let me, let me just sit on Lewis's lap here. Uh, yeah. No, no, this is good. No, it's, here we go. Ah. Hey, Lewis. Oh, whoa. All right, we got some production in news today. Uh, production is going fine. We're going to be on TV. All that's good, but... Uh, we had a we had an incredible production breakthrough today. Oh yeah. Yeah. There's a everyone. If you've got your computers handy, if you're sitting there, uh, type in this address onto your computer screen. Type in 
YDHWM dot com. And uh, it'll take us take Whoa. you to our new website. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a new one. Check it out. It's gonna have everything you, you could ever it? dreamed. Did you guys buy a domain name? I did. Is there anything on it right now? Uh, there's a little bit on it. It's pretty, uh, as, I, as I speak, for the viewers a week ago, uh, it's pretty bare bones. But by the time you're watching this on TV or on YouTube, I bet that it's looking pretty good. Uh, give us uh, some feedback if you think it needs some improvements. But How it's, are you making it? Uh, we're using Google Sites. Ooh. Google Sites and the Google Google Apps thing. So cool. that's working out pretty good, seems like. Pretty, mm. pretty good financial. Uh, check it out. Yeah, check it out. Y D H W M. That's the letters for your daily hour with me. I feel dot bad, com. kind of, because I feel like Google might be evil, but I also love them. Yeah, I thought their slogan was to not be evil. What? Oh yeah, their I main rule is to not be evil, but they might still be evil. But I still like them. Right. What are they yeah. doing? What are they doing that's evil? They're not really like doing it. Collecting the internet. They yeah. downloaded the internet like all those times. Yeah, uh -huh. and they're collecting tons of information on people. Isn't they that helpful? Aren't they just trying to help people with, by collecting the internet? Yeah, but if it falls into the wrong hands, it can be bad. Like that's, you know, they've also they, they they've done a pretty good track record of like when the government says, "Hey, give us all the emails of the people who have downloaded bad things or searched things or something." They'll say, "No, that's private." Yeah. But you never know when you know someone else is going to get in charge or like. You know, regulations force them to give up that information. So it's like slightly dangerous, but it's also pretty convenient to be able to like have all your stuff on the same account. Can you hack Google? Have people mm. hack? Can you, I mean, oh, this is news. Somebody, some hacker, just got sixty thousand dollars for uh, finding a flaw in the Google Chrome application, the Whoa. web browser. And instead of exploiting it, he brought it to the attention of Google, and they paid him a bunch of money and fixed oh it. Oh, my God. Yeah. So maybe, you know, everything can be hacked if the hacker is smart enough. But uh, they've got, you know, teams of people who do that to stop them. You know, they can throw their weight around quite a bit, I bet, with Google. Yeah. The public. Yeah. All right, well, here's another message. It's one from Dan Dobler. See how he's doing. Hi, Kenny. This is Dan. Yeah, you, ha you haven't called me for a while. You can call me back. You can call me back. Bye. I think we'll call him back. If he's sleeping, he won't answer. We'll see if he's awake. It's a little bit late right now. But Does he stay up late? Uh, mm, sometimes. It really depends with, with Dan. He sometimes is up late, sometimes he's not. We're going to find out. If he's, if he's uh, sleeping, he won't answer for me. Yeah, if sleeping. If we wake him up. We'll see if, yeah, what Dan has been doing. We'll see if he's heard any news. How's it going, Dan? How you do? How you do? <laughs> hey. How you do? Yeah. Well, maybe he's not going to answer. Oh. Hello? Hello? Hey, Dan. Hey. How you doing? We're on TV. TV. Yeah, how, how you doing? We're good. How are you? Oh. Are you there? Yeah, hello. Can you hear me? Yeah. Uh, I, I'm doing okay. Are you watching TV? Yeah, I'm about... Well, I'm not watching TV now. I'm not watching TV. I, I, I'm in bed. Was it the radio? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, you How are you doing? Oh, we're doing good. Did you celebrate? Uh, I'm doing. Good. Did you celebrate Columbus Day? What? Did you celebrate Columbus Day? No. So, hey, we're here with Freddie is here and Brianna and and Lewis. Hey, Dan. Oh, you're in a That's nice. <laughs> uh, do you, are you going to vote? What? Do right, you see anything on the streets lately? No. No? How about, uh, no. How about any news? you see any news? 
Dan, it's info time. Here are some answers. Can you read this? Here are some answers to some frequently asked questions about the program. You're oh, watching it right before. now, and it's called Your Daily Hour with Me. It's a, it's on every day. That's seven days a week, 365 days a year, 366 on leap years. It's a call-in show that tapes at different times it, of the it, day. It, 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 so when you yeah. call, leave a message, and we'll call you right back. Anybody can come on the program, especially you. Edward? The program tapes in Olympia, Washington, and you can watch on TCTV, Thurston County Channel 22, on, at 11.30 or on YouTube. It tapes a week <laughs> in advance, so if you're watching on TCTV, this episode taped on the same day of the previous week. Uh, Please you call in yeah, and tell on, your man. friends about the program. Your Daily Hour with me relies on the community for content. So, uh, thank you, and now... Let's get back to the program. Woo! Yeah. Hey. Hey, Dan, hey, Dan. it's Freddie here. What's up? Hey, 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 is Cedric there? I'm here. It's me. I'm talking to you right now. Well, how are you doing? I'm doing good. My phone, I lost it when I went oh, uh, no. to Vancouver, and I have not had a phone since then. So, uh, oh. Yeah, it's I, it's one of my curses. I seem to lose phones more than I say other people do. Maybe. Yeah, that, that's why. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, that's why you haven't called me. Yeah, that's why I haven't given you a call a little, in a little bit. How you been? What's uh, what's anything new going on? You seen anything? Uh, you did you, did you go to a movie Is, this week? No, 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 no. The same thing. I I did the same thing. Uh, I see Sunday, right? Oh yeah, Sunday's gonna be a good time. We're gonna shoot some more Agent Jim, and Mertice is gonna be in town. It'll be good. Yeah. Well, uh, I see Sunday. Okay, cool. Uh, Dan, are you gonna? Are bye. You gonna, oh, oh, bye. <laughs> there he goes. Thanks, Dan. Yeah. Well, that was the that's the next info time. Well, we haven't done info time in a couple of days. Maybe you guys have seen it now. We'll go back to the messages here. Who else called? Next, uh, the other message is from... Oh, uh, Sadie says, I miss you guys already. Oh, Sadie. Thanks, Sadie. That's really sweet. Sadie is uh, where we're in the old studio there, so we'll be back going back in there in a month. Though, we're, yeah. we're remodeling the, uh, the, the new studio, so... We're yeah. going to see, um, doing some renovations. We're trying to install a door. And uh, once we get it all set up, then we're going to move back in. So, um, you know, these things take time. Sometimes we need studio upgrades on the program. And that's happening. Yeah, this is a temporary spot. This is a message from an uh, unknown caller here. Okay. Let's see who they are. We don't know who they are yet, so we to listen to this message. So I'm always kind of... I'm nervous about unknown callers usually on my personal phone. Hey, Kenny, it's Mike Coday. Hey, we've got all, a good a space all set for you at the uh, People's Movement Assembly. You're in uh, SEM 2. We've got a, a nice spot with couches and uh, less less traffic and noise than we had last year. That's oh, yeah? Much better. Um, also, I talked to Bird, and Bird said he would uh, be uh, moving bon or moving your guests in and out so you can have a uh, uninterrupted um, camera time and keep it moving. So I think we're all set. Um, send me an email or call me. Uh, the number is 360 oh, ah. Get back with details or uh, give us an email. Send us an email. It's Mike or Mary Lee. Mike at smallblueplanet.org. Oh, yeah, call the number. Or like Mary Lee at smallblueplanet.org. Okay, also you could try calling us. What is this guy trying to do? Is he soliciting? No, uh, this is that, you did this event last year. Wait, is this the one where we went to, what was the, the place yeah, downtown? This is the piece rally where they told us to be quiet. We're trying oh, to see yeah. the show. But they're, they're that implying that you have a better spot this time where you're not going to get shushed. Yeah, I think he says it's uh, Evergreen this time, too. Have you ever filmed at Evergreen? No, I don't know about this thing. I don't know what it is. People, they're, they're inviting the program to some... It's on the twentieth. I really, I mean, me and Lucy, we didn't have that good of a time last year. Uh, we were kind of in a corner. It was kind of weird. It was supposed to be a peace rally, but people, the people were kind of 
mad about peace, you know? Oh. Yeah. yeah. Angry peace people? Angry well, peace. Yeah, I mean, they just, like, there was, like, a bunch of different, like, panel discussions going on in the same room as us, but we had microphones and nobody else did, so they like, came over and, like, can you stop? Uh, like, no. <laughs> we can't stop. It's going. Sorry, can't, can't stop, stop for another hour. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go the whole hour, that's kind of the rule. Yeah, they tried to stop us, and it was, it was a little yeah. weird. Some people came over and tried to talk to us, but I think most people were just, like, unhappy we were there. I think if we go back, um, I think still, like, most of the people there won't know who we are. Maybe, I think all you need is a sign, just a sign that says, Your Daily Hour, or maybe a flyer. I think last time we got accused of being, like, the media. What? They're, they're like, <laughs> they're like, are you the media? Get yes. out of here, the media! What are you trying to do? What? Like they're trying to like the media? To, we're, out of here. That we're trying to get in. I don't know. I don't know if anybody actually said that to me. I'm just trying to remember from the year ago, but I think that's what they were like. They were like, yeah. they thought we were like spies. What day is the twentieth? It's Thursday. Oh, it's on. It's Saturday. on a Saturday. Oh, it's Saturday. Yeah. Okay. Hey, so. I could even come on. Come to that. Huh. Saturday the twentieth. Is that Saturday what you said? Twentieth. Yeah. Of like October. Um, what time of day is it at? No, we're calling Bird here. Let's see if he's gonna answer. Oh, that's okay. a good idea. I think I have to work that day, but I'll try to come. Hello. Oh, hello, Bird. Did we wake you up? Hey. No. <laughs> no, I'm awake. What's the thing called? People's. People's. People's movement. peace movement. Something. Do we you know about that, Bird? About the people's peace movement. The is that PPP? Uh, people's peace movement. People's peace or oh, PPM? PPM. PPM. So what is, what's with that? We got invited to that, or did you do that? On the is 20th? it the twentieth? Oh, yeah. Some somebody told me that you're going to the People's Movement Assembly. Is that so? Oh, well, we just we just got invited. I guess we are. Yeah. Uh, is it on the twentieth, Bird? Yeah. Do you know what time it is? Do it. Um, I think it's like. I think it's kind of all day. I think it might even start at 8 a.m. and there's going to be coffee. Whoa. I think it's at Evergreen. Oh, wow. Wait, is this the same thing that we went to last year that was at um, the Olympia Center? Or is this different? Yeah. It is the same? See, that'd be kind of cool. You, we, we could check back in with some, some people who maybe were angry and maybe this time they won't be as angry. Yeah. yeah. Maybe yeah. Bruce will be there again. I remember Bruce was there and it was kind of awkward for me. It was a little weird last year, but do you remember that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, I think I know. There's there's a fake wedding going on that day too. Oh, it's gonna be. Uh, Lexi and Blen are getting fake married, but wow. it's kind of weird because it's like. It's not like my fake wedding where it's just for show. It's like a fake wedding that's like a precursor to them actually probably getting actually Maybe married in the future. Why? I don't know, because they're into each other. Oh, oh, they're dating. Yeah. It's not like fake, fake. No, Medi it's just not legal. Medium fake. Medium fake, medium rare. So they're... Well, that's confused. Why would they just get, like, real married or something? I don't know, because they've only been dating for a couple months. They don't want to sign a thing. Yeah. Oh, but they want, they want to have a wedding? Yeah, I guess so. It's on October 20th. I got invited to it. That's confusing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I already checked in. I worked 12 to 4 that day. So hopefully I can go to this Does, does it go till after 4? Does it go into the evening, Bird? Um, I don't know what the actual schedule looks like. I think they're working that out right now. Um, let me, let me try to find this. Maybe you can find the schedule, but if it's after, you you could do before noon, then maybe we have to yeah. go there early. Yeah, we could go at 8 a.m. We maybe. could do a breakfast thing, yeah. Bre Get the breakfast coffee and tell them talk. peace in the morning, nothing like a little peace in the morning. Yeah, I don't know what they're going to be doing there. Last time it was weird. If these it was. Yeah, I mean, I think it would be good if you guys were there and just like... You know, it was plucked as an opportunity for people to, to go out and, you know, they can be on your show and talk about what they're working on. Yep. Yeah. Well, maybe. do you think, are we going to have our own room this time? Because I think maybe, like, the main issue last time is that we are in with a bunch of panels, but then we were louder than everybody else. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. 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 I wasn't there. I don't. I don't really know. <laughs> <laughs> All Not right. Well, in the organizing you know, either. So. Well, Bird, do you, you want to come on the program on Friday? Yeah. You could tell us about this. Probably. Yeah. I don't know. Do you want? Do you want to? Do you think I should be there? Yeah. Yeah. Because then you could tell us about this. This. Uh, try to get some more details about this thing. Especially th if it's okay, this I'll Friday, that's still enough time to encourage I'll other people to come. Details. Can you be, yeah, Bird? Can you be the ambassador? To be there too. I don't know if I want to talk to this other guy. So you c you could be the ambassador for the program to these for the the. BPM. I could talk to him. I'm the producer. I could do that. Oh yeah, but Bird Bird is sure. in already in on it. Yeah, that's true. They talked to me too at work. I didn't tell you that I told them to call, but I did. Oh. That's why the message is there. Oh okay. <laughs> 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 okay, we already, we already have an ambassador, so. But you can also doubly do it if you want, just for fun. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'd I'd be happy to be like a you know special envoy or something. Yeah. You know, yeah. Special envoy. Whatever. Special envoy. I want to yeah. find people that like. You know, I can go bird dog people that. Ooh. On the show. Is it bird dog? <laughs> hey, it's time for the best game. D dog. Uh, bird dog, bird, bird dog. Are we supposed to pick a new number? No, no we're gonna no, you're you're stuck with the number for the rest of the bird, hour. Bird, bird. Nice going. game. That's my shoe. Bird, you want to guess a number? Yeah. Um, when should I say it? Uh, I say okay, well, yeah, so here, roll and then say. Okay, say it, bird. What is it? Six. Oh! oh! One. Right. I mean, Lewis has 500 points too. I also won. Oh, yeah. wow. Every, everyone is tied I now. Everyone at 500. I everyone. think everybody except for a, a one, right? Do you have a two? I have a two. Yeah, I think every number except for one has been rolled so far. So it's what? been very No, equal. there's two. It's, uh, there can only be there's six numbers on there. So yeah, only oh, four yeah. numbers <laughs> have been rolled. Three hasn't been. Oh yeah, three, three oh, hasn't been. One three. and three. Charlie is not winning yeah. either. Okay, well, we'll see you on Friday, Bird. We're not at the studio anymore. We're at the new studio for a while, so you'll get to see it. Awesome. Okay. Thanks, Bird. You're at, you're at, the, new, whoa, you're at the new studio? Yeah, we'll send you, I'll send you the address off the, off the air here, okay? What the heck? Yeah, we're, we're, remodel, <laughs> we're remodeling. What happened? We're remodeling. We're taking... We're, uh... We're we're on the the other studio is being remodeled. We'll be back in there maybe a week or or so. So good. I like that place. You did? He yeah. likes it. Did he, he said he likes it. Or did you hate it? What? How do you I'm feel? Just, I'm you? curious to see how cold it's gonna get in the winter there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. But we'll have a heater. But also. Oh, man. Also, you just wear a jacket because people waste a lot of their body energy, I think, you know, when they're not wearing a big jacket in the winter. Um, you get cold, just get a bigger jacket. Yeah, it would take so much electricity to do that. Yeah. Use your own body heat. Okay. okay. Thanks, Bird. We'll uh, see you on Friday. Wonderful. Okay, bye. Bye. All right, that's going to be a, a weird thing. We're going to see if they, <laughs> if they, we, if, if. Any more messages? The nope. That's all the messages. Okay, I wanted to say thanks for putting up that video of that kid singing grenade. Oh it's, yeah, it's funny to watch again. If you're watching this on YouTube, yeah, check out that that kid. That was a weird thing. I don't even. You think that was planned out? No, I don't think so. Yeah, we were at this uh, at the Volcano Lounge uh, during the arts walk, and some kid just uh. Did from I guess karaoke of this of the Catcher Grenade song. He when? was uh the Bruno Mars. Oh. I don't think I ever heard that song. He he had like the little kid uh it's not good. The thing where he says like uh like twee and stuff, you know, like little kid accent and stuff. Uh, you know? <laughs> like he has his his he, it's like I think it's people their like tongues aren't aren't long enough so they they say funny words. Oh, like they, little kids, you know? Yeah. He had that kind of kind of accent thing, huh. and so it's super. It's like the cute accent, you know. It's also funny how in in the video, like 
you like started getting off, you know, like you started like looking at like these coffee cups for a second, and like uh-huh. before that you were like, you're like, oh, this is gonna go viral. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Check it out. <laughs> it's gonna go viral. People love kids and pop music. Yeah, so. get on it first. Yeah, people do love that. They love kids like singing and dancing to pop music. Yeah. Yeah. Do you do you guys know about the six-year-old rapper? I haven't heard about that. No. It's kind of fucked up. He has a like. He's good. No. It's it's like a six-year-old who's rapping around like normal rap rapper things like, I get with all the ladies like shit like that. Oh no. And it's like he's like dancing with like women in bikinis. But he's six. His parent. What were his parents? His, his parents are making the video, I think, and oh. they sponsored it. They're just bad parents. Wouldn't that be bad if his mom was in the bikini? Like, she was a dancer? Yeah, that would be gross. Yeah. <laughs> they're just trying to keep afloat. Maybe they're trying to get the kids to put the kids yeah. to college. Yeah, get the money. Yeah. yeah oh, yeah. Oh, uh, I have something to tell the viewers about. Maybe they already know about it. It's a store called the E-Mart. Mm-hmm. What's it's in, that? It's in the basement of the Eagles Ballroom. It's a thrift store that's, like, really cheap. Whoa, I want to go. Yeah, it's only open on the weekend. Saturday, 9 to 6. Sunday, I think, 10 to 4. Wow. But I went there. Um, I got this really funny set of a, a platter and some plates that it was, like, a pizza-themed and the shade, the Oh, you got that? Yeah, the plates are pizza shaped. And then there's like a weird like face that's made of peppers and olives on all of them. It's for pizza? Like fits, it's like triangular? Yeah, it's really cute. Triangular. So you eat on it and it like fits the pizza slice? Yeah, yeah, there's like a big one for the pizza and there's plates for the individual slices. Oh, yeah. Or pie? Yeah. Other slice, slice, (laughs) circular foods? Yeah. Oh, getting a personal phone call. Huh? Yeah, I'm getting I hear a personal, buzzing. Personal phone call. You have any other stories from the tour? Uh, I'm going to mm-hmm. answer this. You guys see any uh, sto- stories from your tour on the streets or anywhere else? Yeah, what's up? Um, when you're traveling when around? When I was in El Paso, I rode around in a pink limo. Yeah, um, I'm Whoa. Right How did that happen? I um, was hanging out with my friend Zoe Sword. Okay in El Paso, and yeah, her friend, cool. I think, just for some while. reason, had a, a pink limo, and we all rode around in it and drank a lot. Well, it was a private one? I don't know, but we had it all night. Um, uh, yeah, it was a crazy night. But you can, yeah, people can drink in the limos, I guess, in the back, it's a separate part of it. Yeah, it was really weird. It was a weird experience. Yeah. I mean, then I, I threw up outside the limo. Like Whoa, because it was probably, that probably that pretty hard work. to... Be uh, drinking so in a car, or moving around all the time. Like yeah, it was. Yeah, like well, that like wasn't because Friday it was just because. Um, I, I don't know. P- too, there's like too much going on inside the limo. Too many people passing things. In the limo, yeah. Yeah, yeah you know, so people just like, hey, take this. Friday. It's a pink. It was a pink limo, but that was somebody. Somebody owned it. You knew the owners. I have no idea how it came to be. I just kind of went with it. I was like, oh, yeah, pink limo. Let's get this limo. Did they have uh, uh, disco balls and, like, uh, you know, crazy lights and stuff in there? TVs? No, there are no TVs. There's fancy wine glasses. That was it. Like on the, on the walls, like a bar? Yeah, it was like a bar. I'm trying to think of another crazy story, but... Um, in Houston, we played at this place, and this woman, who I thought was awful, she kept playing ukulele covers of ABBA all night long. Oh, no. It was so bad. As a performance? Just like, that was her thing. Like, that's her thing. She does YouTube covers on the ukulele and puts them up on YouTube every day. Just in the bar? No, it was like a weird venue. Oh, so did she like stop and start again? Yeah, she w- did. She like couldn't get the song right. So she kept oh no! Would go like almost all the way through it, but mess up and then start over again. And oh, she did what? it until like three in the morning, and then when I woke up the next day at ten a.m., she was doing it again. 
Why? I wanted to kill myself. I was like, we have to get out of here, Lisa. Too much ukulele. And she was singing Fernando. So. Oh man, that's that's too much. There we go. Let's take a break. Commercial break. Dance, holy dance. And this is not happening anymore. Dance, holy dance. <laughs> it's, not, <laughs> it's not happening anymore. Live TV here. dance. Oh, that's sad. First Friday. It's gonna be at some house. Here. Are they gonna film it? Yeah, look it up on the internet. TCTV Studio A, 440 Yager Way. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Coming up tomorrow here. It's a commercial for tomorrow's episode. Watch it. Hey, me. Yeah, hey everybody. <laughs> Call the show. We're on TV once a day, every day. Oh, whoa. Turn on the machines for the week. Start talking. We're gonna be talking here for an hour. Yeah. It's uh, right there. There's the number. You can call this number. Get yourself on TV. Watch the show every day. Jared's here. Yeah, we watch the sun go down. It's a good time. Yeah. The presidential debates are happening. Debates. Watch oh. the show. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. Way, it's back to the program with us. Here we are. With us. We're going to call uh, the McDonald's. Maybe we should call Mr. Gintu back, too. Oh, yeah. What did he say in his message? Let's see. Something about... Oh, he didn't like the emergency broadcast. Right. Oh, yeah. Let's see about how that went with him. Uh, did you ever figure out the thing about whether he said his first name or not? Oh, no, you know, we, I was on a mission to do that myself uh -huh. as the production end because I had to capture that tape like three times. Uh huh. And yeah. every time, like when I'm capturing it, I can't go back and review. Uh -huh. I can only watch it straight through. And so I was yeah. waiting and waiting every time, and I'd always get distracted. And then I'd like come back and check in again, and then you were just saying, like, oh, I think he just said his first name. He said, <laughs> you know, his, talking about his mom, right? And she said yeah. something, Melvin, stop doing that, or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, should, we shouldn't ask him, though. Maybe. Yeah, we'll, no, we'll, we'll, we'll ask him about that. We have to confirm first before yeah. we say anything. Because uh, he doesn't want us to know who he is, you know? Yeah. Yeah, he's remained anonymous for almost two years. It's quite a feat. Remained anonymous. anonymous. And yet we know a lot about him, about his past and how his... Um, so, yeah. secret stuff. Secret life. Your call is so to an automatic voice message system. Three, six, zero. Oh! oh. It's not available. Uh, Mr. Ginsu, it's a program. You can call us back in about 20 minutes. We don't like yeah. those test signals either. Yeah, fuck those. Yeah. And they make an annoying sound, too. Beep. Like, <laughs> and then you're like, it's gonna, you're right about to get to it. It's like, who's the, who did it? You know, it's like, who killed them? And it's like, oh, emergency. And then it's like, good thing we didn't get in trouble too. You know, <laughs> oh, like, oh. the whole. You scared? You think there's an emergency? No, it's a test. Yeah. It's like crying wolf. How do they expect us to trust it ever? Oh, how many people have really been in, in an emergency like that? I mean, I guess probably, yeah, like, if there's like a tsunami or a hurricane. Probably they had it for like Hurricane Katrina. But like, really, how many times is there like a natural disaster? Well, it's still good to have emergency signals on. Better safety, yeah. sorry. Hey, look, Jared's coming here tomorrow, and also, it looks like it's Brianna's birthday tomorrow. <gasps> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's coming up. Happy coming. birthday. Thanks. Yeah, you should call into the program tomorrow and wish yourself in a year happy birthday. Oh, yeah. okay. That's what you can do. Yeah. What are you going to do? I want to go to the zoo. Whoa. Oh. And yeah. do field uh, recording. Oh, animal sounds. Mm -hmm. The yeah. uh, Point Defiance Zoo or like Northwest Trek? Point Defiance. I've never, I've, never I've never been there. What kind of oh, animals yeah. are you looking to see? Lots of them. All of them. The, the the ones. I want to go to the oh. fish and the birds and the, the weird ones. The weird ones. The weird ones. That's my favorite normal section, normal too. Animals. Yeah, the, the weird weirdos. <laughs> here's all the normal animals, and here's the weirdos. The zebra. I like <laughs> the, the tapir. That's my favorite weird animal. What's that? 
It's like a pig, but it's kind of got a long snout, and it's furry and brown and small and cute. Cute pig animal. Yeah. Uh, Snuffles. You still want to try to get a pumpkin paper. milkshake, <gasps> Oh, can we get a pumpkin milkshake at midnight? Yes, uh, yeah. probably. Maybe. What, or they might shut off. The, when do they shut off their machines? Uh, we oh, can find fuck, out. That always happens. I hate that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll call them. <laughs> they gotta clean them. Yeah, you should. All right. Oh, Jared. Yeah. Hey, it's the program. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh wait, yeah. am I calling from the wrong number? I think. Uh oh. I, call, I forgot to switch out the numbers. Um, you're scheduled for tomorrow. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What time? Um, how about in the in the afternoon? Yeah, that sounds good. Ooh, if you do it after five, I could do. It. Oh, how about at at, right. at what what six? Six. How about at six? Six. Yes. Six o'clock. Yes. Oh, that will that sounds wonderful. Yay! Um, yeah, for, we're here with Freddy. Hey, hey, Jared, it's Freddy. I'm going to come on the show with you tomorrow, too, if that's all right with you. Oh, uh, is that Freddy? Yeah. Can I can I come on the show with you tomorrow? Oh, yeah, of course, yeah. <laughs> that's, good, that's the right answer. Um, Joe, do you see anything on the streets lately? Did I see anything on the streets? Oh, yeah, maybe we should save it for tomorrow. Don't Bye. tell us if you did. <laughs> 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 we want to hear it tomorrow. Yeah. Just think about it, though. Okay. Yeah, I'll think about that. What? Uh, what is your surroundings? Yeah. What are you doing right now? Yeah. What am I doing? Yes. Uh, I am downtown with Barbara and John and Rock McCoy. Oh. Oh, uh, what's happening there? Uh, well, we are having some beers and talking. Some uh, exciting stuff. Yeah. Are they? Uh, are they showing the game? Uh, I don't know. I'm outside. Okay. <laughs> anybody, anybody crazy yeah. out there? There's nobody. Anybody yelling at the bar, on the streets? No, it's just a pretty, uh, pretty, pretty reasonable night. There's uh, nothing really, really, nothing of note that happens really. Oh, great. All right. Thanks, Greg. Yeah. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. See ya. I, I thought of something that I saw on the streets. Mm -hmm. uh, it was Lisa Hurwitz. I saw Ooh. her a couple times. Yeah. Uh, this one time. With the dog? No, not with the dog. She was with her aunt and her aunt's 90 year old boyfriend. Whoa. At Whoa. The China Clipper. I went there too. I sang some songs. And then I saw her again today. And I was. Last night I was dressed like a baseball. Guy, <laughs> Wait, like a baseball player, like a baseball. Yeah, I was wearing baseball yeah. pants and a baseball uniform shirt that match. I got the shirt at the E Mart too. Wait, I got so a are you a player? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Playing baseball. Not a baseball Don't hate player the game. though. Just like I do. I play people <laughs> <laughs> and games. Like baseball, but not baseball. Don't play baseball, <laughs> but other games. Um, Dice games. Yeah, to play the dice game whenever I'm here. Um, but then I asked, well, I asked Lisa because I was confused about when All Freaking Night was. Uh huh. It was a week earlier, and Lisa explained to me why she did that. That's a good. That's a good thing. Can you explain it to the viewers? What's up? Uh yeah. So it's usually All Freaking Night is the closing night of the film festival, but this year it's actually in the first weekend. So it's uh the night of November 10th going into November 11th. Um, the reason the reason Lisa gave was that usually it's you know the theater's pretty packed for all freaking night, and she you know it's a, it's a, basically it's a marketing decision that she wants like the photo opportunity of like all the people like waiting in line to get in and like the theater being packed, but then also like the people who go, it won't be like they go and then it's over. It's like they go and then. Oh, there's still another week of oh, the yeah. film festival. Oh yeah, it's all the same people. Go they're gonna trash. I think it gets trashed usually, and then they have to clean it up. That's what they do at the end, though. Oh. So we'll yeah. see if it. Uh -oh. if it well, because the big be the, isn't the big opening one the opening night. Is the opening night still gonna happen before or it's after? It's the day before. Opening yeah. is on a Friday, and this thing's on the Saturday. Well, that's actually yeah. pretty cool, I guess. It's like double whammy, two huge events in the like back to back yeah. to kick it off. Is there gonna be a finale still, or do we need to ask uh, the director about that? I think there is a finale. The, the program is out. Um, yeah. Also, another exciting thing that I didn't know, but uh, Fred Willard is coming. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I heard about that. Yeah. What you is he doing? Is, um, he's 
like, they're showing Best in Show, and he's gonna, like, do a QA and a about that, and then there's, like, a after party with him at <laughs> a wine bar called Swing that I didn't even know it existed. Oh, it's, oh. On, it's on that street. Yeah, apparently it's a very Water swanky street. place that's appropriate for movie stars. <laughs> Especially satirist. It sounds like the th- place a satirist would pick. Yeah. I've seen that place, but it looks fancy. <laughs> it is it's pretty fancy. I think it's too fancy for me. A little too fancy. To yeah. Ask me. Are you going to go, Luke? I don't know. Well, you should dress really nice and, and try and just go. You look like Fred yeah. Willard here. Yeah, I think it's like twenty dollars. You want to roll? roll? Brianna, you, really have you roll rolled the other ones? You want to roll? Um, yeah. I already rolled. Brianna should roll. Yeah, Brianna. Here we go. This is the final one. This is for all the the points here. Cause it's for the win. Oh. Uh, Oh, Lewis Two and three. Wait. Oh, no, I, no, didn't, no, I didn't. I no. didn't wait. I had six. No, no Freddy just Freddy. Won. Just you. Oh, wait. I thought the three was a six. I just was, you. You I'm won. I'm a winner. Wait, no one else is two? No. Nope. No. Nope. Five. It's wow. you. Five. Wait, just hold it up the other way. <laughs> That's the five. S. Is still a five? Oh, sorry. Kick S. No, it can't it's be not a not a number. Freddy is the winner today. No. Well, uh, <laughs> I'm excited about a special guest at the Olympia Film Festival as well. Um, but I'm I'm most excited for uh, it's one of the Elfman brothers. It's either Richard or Danny Elfman. Probably yeah, Richard. Yeah, the, the other one. It's Richard. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, there, he in? he's in um, the movie The Forbidden Zone, which is one of my favorite like non sequitur comedies. Danny Elfman's brother. Yeah. I mean, it's a uh, he's they, they were both or maybe just him was in the Mystic Knights of Oingo Boingo, and it's so it's a side project oh, of the whoa, band. That movie? Yeah, that movie. I'm not sure if they're playing it in color or black and white. I hope black and white. But it is one of my favorite movies of ever. And he's going to be there to talk about stuff, too. So check that out. Hi, McDonald. Do you guys have those pumpkin pie milkshakes yet? Uh, no, not yet. Oh, it's Friday. You're going to get them on Friday? Yes. Hey, if I came in on my birthday, would you give me a free milkshake? I'm sorry? If I came to the store on my birthday, would you give me a free milkshake? I'm sorry, can I hear you? Uh, if I came into the store on my birthday, would you give me a free milkshake for my birthday? No. Okay. What if I was your friend? Uh, no. Okay. Thank you. You're doing a great job over there. Who Sorry? else would Oh, you, you guys are doing a great job. All right. Thank you. <laughs> they can hear you laughing. <laughs> yeah. Even when, yeah, you you forget because the I mic. I don't care. You, we talk the mic. Yeah. If you don't have the mic, we're can't hear you. But if you laugh at them, you won't, they won't think they're doing a good job. They'll think that they're not doing a good job and that we're oh. being um, like a uh, sarcastic or something. Like you're doing a good job, and then people laugh <laughs> and it's like, oh, they're not doing a good job. Uh, well, they don't. They don't really think I'm doing a good so job. So McDonald doesn't have the milkshake. That would Jack in the Box. That was have them? well. They have them at some of them. They probably have them in, at the local ones. Can you call the local one? Yeah, you want to find out. Well, I we have a real question for them. I want to get the pumpkin pie milkshake. Yeah. My birthday. This is for real. Yeah. Excuse me, it's my birthday. Wait. We're actually gonna go to this one. So here, we'll yeah. call the local McDonald's here, ask them if it's about the milkshakes here. Wait, is the one downtown open 24 hours, or is the one on the wait, west wait, side? The one on the west side. Right? Oh, I think they're actually yes. gonna, they're not open. I think the closest 24 hour one, one is in Lacey. Oh, shit. Oh, I, I thought the downtown one was open 24 Is hours. it? Let's call them. Let's find out here. I think it's not. The I one on the west side I don't think is. No, but it does. it is open fairly late. I think it, yeah. they close it at like 11. 11.30, which is... <laughs> That's right when the maybe they close program com- turns on. Here, this one is on... Wait, which one is this? This is the downtown one. All right. Steve's there 24 hours. Hello? Hello, McDonald's? Hmm. Do they, like, answer and hang up? I don't know what's going on here, yeah. Maybe they, maybe something went wrong. Let's call them one more time. Oh, hello? Nope. 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 All right, we're going to call them again. Hey, hey, McDonald's, how are you doing? Give me your milkshake. This is for real. Really? Usually we're just asking, but now we're really, really hello, hello, oh. really, really asking. That was weird. This is a strange call. Hey. Phone's for McDonald's. 
Hi, McDonald. Do you, uh, what time do you guys close? We're closed right now. Oh. We closed uh, at 11. Um, the one at West Side is open till 2, and their drive through, I believe, is, or in their lobby is open till midnight. Till 2, all right. Thank all you. Right, have a good night. Bye. All right, let's find out if they have their, uh... Pumpkin pie milkshake. Yeah, pumpkin the pie. You like that pumpkin pie stuff? Oh, yeah. Yeah, wow. I want a pumpkin pie milkshake, too. I feel like... I was talking with someone about how girls love pumpkin stuff. Oh. If you oh, talk uh, to girls, they love pumpkin. Wasn't that you that said that? Who said that? That seems like a bit of a generalization, but I mean... I like yeah. pumpkin a lot also, though. Oh, well... I think everybody just loves pumpkin. Who doesn't love me. pumpkin? Not me. I mean, I'm not that like big of a You don't like a big pumpkin spice stuff? No. Mm -hmm. Hi, do you guys keep your uh, milkshakes machine open till you close today? Yes, we do. Oh, great. Thank you. Do you, oh, do you have the pumpkin pie milkshakes right now? No, we do not. Oh. oh. What do you have? What do you have right now for the milkshakes? Just chocolate, strawberry, vanilla. Just the regular ones. Okay, thank you. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, hello. Yes. Oh, uh, when do you, do you know when you get the pumpkin pie milkshakes? Um, we might not even get it. It's not been determined yet. Oh, can I? Can Can you get them? I mean, can you uh, tell them that the customers are asking for them? <laughs> it's not my choice. It's corporate carry, and we are not a corporate store. Oh, can you? Well, I just want to request them. I don't know what you can do about that. If you can tell somebody. Uh, yeah, there's nothing I can do about it. Can Can you it's just tell? What can you tell the boss from now? our distributor? Yeah, can you it's tell? It's a corporate problem. Okay, thank you. No problem. Okay, okay. The, the downtown ones—they've got the <clears throat> the person who runs the the chain, or no? What is it? The you don't call it a chain. Franchise. Franchise in town. It's all one. When it was not. It used to be Linda Berryman, but she is not doing that anymore. Now it's someone else. So maybe they would have some clout. They have her number up, like in every single Olympia McDonald's. Oh yeah. Just like hanging up on the wall. Should we call them? Weird. Some. Yeah, we should. I guess if they're not gonna bring it in, it, what? It's like the. It's the 10th of October, and yeah. they still don't have the pumpkin pie milkshakes. It's like, come on. You like? Up. It's October. You like pumpkin spice, Lewis? Um, I like it okay. I don't really seek it out, but I'll eat it if it's in front of me. I look I forward to it. Jack in the Box always has it. They're assholes, and they always close their machines early. <laughs> yeah. What? I have no oh, idea. you're talking about? They're talking about finances. Yeah, we were, I'm wondering if our roommate paid our internet bill because I think it was due today. <laughs> the finances today. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't. He probably didn't. Oh, the program yeah. is starting on TV. I also called the landlord today and asked him to fix the bathroom sink, but he didn't call me back. Do you think I should call him back again? Uh, yeah. maybe. I mean, does he know who you are? I said who I was. Okay. I told him. <laughs> fix hey, yeah. I am an artist. And Excuse me, my name is Brianna Morella. And you may have heard of me. Yeah. <laughs> I have a SoundCloud. Look me up. Um, yeah. Actually, I don't have a SoundCloud. Oh. Uh, what? Yeah, How well, can the viewers find your stuff? Bandcamp. Oh, yeah. Check out the Bandcamp. Hey, it's the end of the show. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Freddie, Brenna, oh, Lewis. Bro. Yeah, it's only oh, wow. like less than a minute left. Oh, yeah, and well. just one more time, check out that new website. It's ydhwm.com. We don't even... We have the com now. It's the new yeah, one. Commercial. It's professional. It's, dot com. It's Real our new pro. website. Yeah, we never had this one before, so don't go to our new old website anymore. Yeah, hopefully we'll try to figure out a way. If we can get the password to the old one, we can have it forward to the new one. But uh, I don't know how. Yet, because I I tried to I tried to hack into our old, uh, our old website and I couldn't remember any of the passwords. Oh man, well we gotta get some better memory. Thanks everybody. Thanks YouTube. No, it's it's based on your use. Thanks. Yeah, it's totally. Phone. I used Thank to be in charge of the utilities Facebook. at all my old houses. I'm Thanks Twitter. <laughs> you guys tweet? Mm, yeah, sometimes. I'm supposed to be tweeting more often. Thanks, Days. Thanks, crew. You guys are on the crew. Thanks, viewers. That's you. You're watching. You're Thank so you. Cute. Thanks, TCTV. 26 years now. Yeah, I'm sitting behind for the commercial. Thanks, USA. TheBaby.com. Check it out. Hell yeah, dog. Oh, wait, is this going to be the commercial for next week? Next week? Hell yeah. I mean, or tomorrow, I mean, tomorrow. Or tomorrow. Or today. <laughs> or today. Bye.
Bye. Yeah. Is this it?